Attention! The following vlog is a cook-off between me and Bridget. Let me know in the comment section right now who do you think won the cook-off? Me or Bridget? Also, smack the like button if you want me to have a cook-off with Grandpa. Mano y mano. What is it? I cannot escape this game. Click like for a cook-off between me and Grandpa. What's going on, you guys? Kimmy on the camera here. Bridget was here. Right there. And today is Monday. Today is Monday. And today, if you didn't see the vlog we uploaded yesterday, Grandpa had a complete meltdown. Guys, he can't bake bread. At least without a bread maker. Guys, check this out. <laughs> I have bread, too. <laughs> Seeing Grandpa freak out over that bread really made me start to think about intimidating dishes. What are some things that I feel like I can't cook, that I've tried before, failed at, didn't like it? You know what I mean? Yeah. Like... Like everything I cook. Or Chinese food. Guys, I can't make Chinese food for the life of me. I really, really can't do it. And then it made me think of another one. What? Something that I think we need to do tonight. What? Pizza. <gasps> Guys, I, I freaking love pizza. Guys, I cannot make pizza. I've tried before. Neither can I. It was a younger, thinner pickle boy, and he was optimistic and bright-eyed and bushy-tailed, and he wanted to make pizza, and he <laughs> failed at it. And there was also a very hot Bridget back then, but... You're still beautiful. Aww. So, guys... I thought I could make pizza. I couldn't. For one, we used turkey pepperoni. Yeah, what, what were we thinking? What? Like, why would us thin use turkey pep? I was like, I want to keep my thin figure. Now I'm like, I want extra fat pepperoni. <laughs> guys. Honestly, <laughs> me too. Guys, That's exactly how I feel. Turkey pepperoni? Get out of my face! <laughs> guys, today we're making pizza. Today... We're, I, I should have, I screwed that up, I should have ended it. I tell you, guys, today we're making pizza. On our way to the store right now, you guys, to get the stuff to make delicious, scrumptious, actually this time edible pizza. The last time it was not edible. I think we lied on camera and said it was delicious. It wasn't. We got a couple of surprises. We might make a dessert pizza. I don't know. We're definitely going to do like a traditional like pepperoni kind of like hamburger pizza. Just something traditional. And... Bridget had the idea to make an Alfredo pizza. Oh yeah. Alfredo spinach. Oh, yeah. Folks, pizza night is about to be lit. Yeah. Guys, you ain't even ready for this. You ain't, you're not ready. You're not even ready for this, Michael. I'm not ready. No, neither am I. None of us are. I should have let you end it, right? Right. I just had to keep, <laughs> I had to keep the scene going. Cover the lens. We just got to Publix, you guys, and it is time for us to get all the ingredients to make homemade pizza. Oh, yeah. And the first is spinach. Now, I don't know if you guys know what we're doing. What kind of pizza could we be making? Michael, you already told them. What? You already told them. We're making Alfredo pizza. Spinach Alfredo. Okay. I don't know about you, Bridget, but this pizza thing is daunting. <laughs> I think we abandon it. What? <clears throat> Michael. You have a hole in your shirt. What? You have a hole in your shirt. What? Right there. Hey. Hey. Oh. Let's just do the scene. Freaking Chef We Already Pizza Maker. Michael. Okay, dude. Is there seriously Don't you a want to like this pizza? I'm asking you a question. Is there seriously a hole? Yes. And I'm leaving this hole. No, you're not. It's okay, really. If there's a hole, I'm leaving. Michael, it's not a big deal. It's under your arm. We just got home. It's time for us to start our pizza, but first, I wanted to take a minute to talk about the shirt I'm wearing. <sighs> Keemstar is the greatest YouTuber in the world. Damn it, I, I messed it, I'm sorry. Keemstar is the greatest YouTuber in the world and I'm wearing the wrong size shirt. I ordered it, they sent me the wrong size, you guys. This is a freaking large. I don't think I can sport a large, guys. This is, look at this, guys. Come on. Anyway, I'm gonna be wearing this shirt while I make the pizza. Let's hope it doesn't rip off of my body Incredible Hulk style before I finish. Let's cook some pizza. The first step is our pizza sauce, you guys. And we're going with a homemade sauce that starts off with a little bit of olive oil, 
a little butter, and a little garlic. To this, I am adding tomato paste. To this, I am adding salt, pepper, oregano, and sugar. Then the next and hopefully final part is to add one can of crushed tomatoes. This can either be really good or horrible. I'll let you guys know soon. How can it be bad? Hey, there's a lot of ways you can screw up a sauce. So, we're gonna find out if I did that or not. <laughs> Hopefully not. Pretty good sauce, you guys. Completely home, oh, ignore, ignore this. The, okay, <laughs> I wasn't completely happy with this, so I added a little bit of the ragu pizza sauce, My okay? Ball. I'm sorry, it didn't turn out the way that I wanted. Are you? She's like stunned. She's like, I who am I dating? Pizza night's over. It's over. We got our crust all rolled out here, you guys. This right here is garlic butter with basil. And I'm just gonna take this and put it over it first. Next up, it's time for some pizza sauce. Go right over there. Start in the center, go outwards. Mozzarella cheese time. Oh yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. I can do like healthy junk food and get some of that cheese sprinkle. Here we go. You ready, folks? Hold up. Cheese sprinkle. Oh yeah. Hopefully, my pizza's better than Bridget's. No. Guys, this is a battle. Just like healthy junk food, my pizza versus Bridget's pizza. We're going to find out. Honey, we all know this girl's going to win. I'm making Alfredo. A challenge? It's a, it's definitely a challenge. But my pizza's already made over there. But I've already won it. Look, guys, she's got Alfredo sauce cooking up there. You've seen her recipe before. Let's see if it translates to pizza. Here we go, folks. Oh snap! Look at mine. Oh my god! Pickle boys attempt, folks. All right. All right, you guys. I got my pizza cutter. Now this thing has been handed down from generation <laughs> to generation. <laughs> you mind throw my family? <laughs> Didn't buy it at Publix just now. Here we go, folks. <laughs> Get a nice little cut. Oh my gosh. Looks amazing. Oh, I messed up the bottom here a little bit. So crust, the bottom looks like. Here we go, folks. That's good. Oh man. Ah! Oh, Michael. Chill. Mm. <laughs> Good. Folks, my pizza down. Oh my God. Bridget's pizza to go. Told you it was too soon, by the way. A minute ago, she was like, you ready to cut into this? Um, that's I was like, let it cool down. It's too hot. Okay, take another Part bite. for me. Take another bite. Look, look at this thing steaming. It's just, they're just thing. Like, when you eat pizza, you want it hot. Okay, we'll take a bite. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> Cover the lens. You just didn't want to do it. I swear to gosh, I, I really, really, really thought that it wasn't enough. I don't know how you did this, but it's By magic. By spreading it. It's like magic. I couldn't have done that. This is my pizza now. No, it isn't. I made the most important part. Man, the, your garlic butter looks better than mine. <laughs> Look at this. All right, how about this? It's our pizza. Oh, it's your pizza. <laughs> so what is this? This is homemade Alfredo sauce. And I'll, I'll attest to it, you guys, it actually is really good. <laughs> I might win, hon. We'll see. <laughs> so what are you doing now? I'm stirring the spinach in the Alfredo. Oh, man. To give it flavor. You know, like wet spinach. Okay, Bridget, I get it, okay? <laughs> You're better than me. No, I'm not. Dude, this looks good. <laughs> Damn, Bridget. <laughs> You don't gotta palm me so hard. Like, I'm not. Yours looks really good. Like, chill, bro. Oh my god. This is probably good. Here's Bridget's. <laughs> Man, I'm not having none of this. I hope it's good. It's gotta be. How can this. <laughs> Guys, I'm afraid. Bottom? Yeah. <laughs> Time out, folks. <laughs> it's like I'm trying to sabotage her. Hey! Hey! 
Of course not. This vlog started <laughs> as a battle. <laughs> Me versus Bridget. The pizza cook-off. The great pizza cook-off. That Michael was gonna win, right? And then I saw her pizza. <laughs> Folks, feast your eyes on this. Oh my God. No way. <laughs> Dude, Bridget. Oh, yeah, keep blinking in my eyes all sarcastically thinking you the best. Oh my God. Just open the trash. Hey, no, this is really good. Not this good though. What if it tastes like crap? Oh, look at that melty cheese. Oh my God. <laughs> I tap. <laughs> I'm done with pizza making. She beat me. Dude, I'll give it to you. That was good. Oh my god, Bridget. Let's do the crust test. Oh damn, bro. She wins on all fronts. Well, you cut it at least. Let's cut some pizza. This is just beautiful. I don't know, dude. This right here is what Picasso was going for. <laughs> True art. Right here, guys. Oh, I can't say nothing. What if it's horrible? It's it, not gonna be. And it tastes like crap. It won't. <laughs> it even cut like real pizza. Holy crap. This was, is better than mine on all fronts. Look at this. <laughs> no, it's not. Look at that. Oh my gosh. All right, here we go, folks. Good. Yay. Bridget wins. <laughs> really? She wins. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I thought I had something special there. All right, who's your vote for? You. That, you she's just, see, I don't like that, okay? Don't have pity on me and give me a vote. Your pizza obviously wins. Guys. It's so good. Seriously, that's, if you want to make one at home, Woo! do that one. Really good. The Alfredo sauce is really simple. What was the recipe for that? Heavy cream, butter, garlic, salt, pepper, parm cheese. It's really simple. Mm -hmm. You let it cook, let it thicken up a little bit. Guys, it's time to put our dessert pizza in. She wins. All right, you guys. Now comes the part that none of y'all was ready for. Dessert pizza. Now, I've already made the dessert pizza it's in the oven, but I am gonna show you the step-by-step -step process. First step was I took vanilla pudding and I mixed in some cream cheese. Step three, I added marshmallow fluff. I mixed it, I added it on a pizza, and I popped it in the oven. This, hopefully, is a brand new pizza that we invented and not a complete fail that's gonna set our house on fire. Let's hope we don't set our house on fire because it's a very real possibility. Well, here's the pizza, you guys. Now, adding a little bit of this chocolate syrup. And a little bit of a spiral. Boom. Here we go, Bridget. Do Why you... are you kneeling? Because I don't want to sit. I don't know. Do you, <laughs> you want to eat this? Okay. Good. <laughs> Yo, this is real good. <laughs> Folks. I need to try those. Folks. <laughs> You went ready, Bridget. Why are you kneeling? I like to be like you. Come on. It's so good. Come on, take another bite of that baby. Folks, we just invented a freaking dessert pizza. This was like a custard pizza. I baked it, chocolate syrup. This thing is good. Now we're gonna finish up the vlog. We got a little more living to do. Not much, mostly a cooking vlog. That's almost going to be it for today, you guys. Thanks for watching. Going to be doing the outro in just a second. Before I do the outro, I wanted to take this moment to ask for your guys' opinion. Okay, got a little too dark. Maybe stick around here. Guys, I want to know your opinion on what kind of thing me and Grandpa should cook if you guys want us to do the cook-off. So first, click the like button if you want us to do the cook-off. Two, if you want us to do the cook-off... Let me know what you think we should cook. I'm trying to trying to do something more fun for Grandpa. You know, it's kind of monotonous for him just sitting in his house. He wants to have a little bit of fun. I know it's 
boring him to death just chilling in that house and I can understand so I'm trying to think of some fun stuff for him to do I'm working on the you know gummy food real food challenge you guys clicked like for that a while ago so I got that planned I'm trying to have a lot of fun with him I think a cook-off is exactly what he needs so let me know in the comment section what do you think we should do smack the like button if you think we should have the cook-off that's gonna be with me and grandpa but anyway outro time Bridget I don't know how you did it but your pizza destroyed my pizza and I'm stunned she beat me well that's gonna be it for today you guys thanks for watching if you're wondering why am I wearing this it's a form of humiliation because I lost the cook-off wearing what Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Guys, Bridget beat me in the cook-off. I gotta give it to you. You won. No, you won. Dude, you quit being modest, okay? You're allowed to win sometimes. No, but usually when I tell Michael the truth, he cries his eyes out and craps his pants. That's not that's not true. So <laughs> And he goes to bed early. You won, hon. It, guys, Bridget beat me in the cook-off and she knows it, okay? I'm Thanks for watching. Remember, let me know what kind of food you want me and Grandpa to have a cook-off with. That'll be fun. Hopefully nothing that I can't cook because that'll be unfair. But anyway, That would be unfair. They're going to be like, you know, freaking pot roast, which I know I can't beat them at. But anyway, guys, that's going to be it for today. Like. Subscribe. Favorite. Follow and everything, Bridget West. And let me put this back on my face. Hold on. You don't need it. Yes, I do. I lost. So what? And I gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> do a dance. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I lost. Okay. <laughs> like, subscribe, favorite. Well, then everything for us. And that's it.